Hi everyone, thank you for the opportunity to shoot this custom video for you. Now, I did quite a bit of research on Valencia's and want to share with you what I found. So let's just go ahead and jump in here. Now, when your future customers are searching for your services, the first thing that they're gonna see when they are searching is what's called the Google Map Pack, and that's right here. Now, ideally we want businesses to be in one of these top three spots, and the reason for that is because this is what instantly is shown in the search results. Now, I did take a look in Valencia's. You guys um, do have a, a listing, which is wonderful. Um, I did take a look and figure out what ranking it's in, and it's currently in 43rd position. Um, so definitely want to, you know, boost it up the ranks and, and get it as high as we can to one of these uh, three spots, right? Because there's a lot of clicks that go on here. Now... Tips for your um, your local map listing here is right away I can see that only one Google review is really hurting you. Um, I know you've got a, a ton of customers that uh, would be glad to probably leave you a review, so that would help tremendously. That's that's one of the things, right? Um, now the second thing that I want to bring to your attention is you need additional citations. What a citation is is any time that your business name, address, and telephone number are mentioned anywhere on Google, Google issues you a citation for that. Now if you had additional citation registrations that would help tremendously as well. What you want to do is you want to figure out how many your number one competitor has, and then you want to beat them by about 50. And the reason for that is because number one, you want to outrank them, obviously. And number two, you want to create a bit of a gap between the two of you so that once you obtain that higher ranking, you're able to maintain and keep it. Okay. Um, now, the next part that people searching on Google we'll see is what's called the organic listings. That's what all of these are down here. Now, this is crucially important because nine times out of 10, anyone searching for a product or a service is going to go with the first page of Google and then one of these higher ranking sites, right? So what I went ahead and did was I determined that your number one competitor is um, Cedar County and I pulled both their site and yours so that we can take a look at both and, and figure out what's going on here. So here is your site. I absolutely love the logo. Um, the picture here, your, your focal header picture image is just beautiful. Um, the site is well done. Uh, you've got, you know, some of your services listed here. Now, here's the issue um, with this site. What Google does 24 hours a day, seven days a week, is it crawls the internet. What that means is it goes through every single website on the internet, and it is looking for two important things. Number one, command content. And command content is every single word on your homepage. The second thing that Google wants to see is within that 1500 words of command content, what they wanna see is organic keywords embedded within that content. That's really key and that's really important. Um, so I did run the numbers and it looks like you guys are sitting at about 228 words. Um, so obviously, you know, building up that content, getting up to that 1500 mark and then embedding the organic keywords throughout would help you climb the ranks um, you know, drastically. Um, now, again, what I went ahead and did was I pulled um, your number one competitor, Cedar County, their site as well, so we can take a look and see what they got going on. Now, um, they've got all their services. The site, you know, is, is really well done. Um, however, they're running into, I like, honestly, I like your guys' images better, but um, they're running into the same same situation. They don't have enough command content. Um, while this is, you know, gorgeous and and the layout is good the fact of the matter is they don't have enough content either they're sitting at um 388 words still not even a third of the way to where that they need to be but this is good though because what that tells us is that adding in additional content on your site with the keywords would allow you to outrank them for content um so this gives us an in, you know, on and 
and a strategy to be able to beat them. So then what I went ahead and did was I pulled my web crawler program. Now what this does is this gives us in-depth information on both sites. So let's just jump right in here. Um, you've got your UR and your DR rating. These are the two most important factors of this whole page. What this means is this is the trust factor rating that Google has assigned to you and this is the power rating. Now it looks like you guys are running seven backlinks and you don't have any organic keywords sprinkled throughout your content and so with all of this considered so um, the needing of additional reviews additional citations um, sitting in the 43rd position needing additional content needing the organic keywords um, and then your backlink situation being at seven no organic keywords which is so 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 important what this gives us is an overall picture that your site is actually not generating any organic traffic to your site. Um, but I want to show you what uh, Cedar County has going on and then give you a little bit of um, uh, additional insight here. All right. So again, their trust factor rating, their power rating. Now they've got over a thousand backlinks running to their site, right? Um, what a backlink is, is essentially a shout out from another website to theirs. So um, what backlinks do is they give you A, credibility, and then B, exposure. They've got 2,200 organic keywords sprinkled throughout their command content, and that's really important. Um, so with considered with them, they've got a organic traffic rating of 612. What that means is that 612 folks every single month are searching for the same exact services in the same exact area that you guys offer. And they are, you know, 612 people are going to the internet searching for those same services and they are clicking on this site, retaining their services, getting additional information, whatever the case may be. The bottom line here is that's a lot of traffic to be missing out on. Um, once more, just like I was saying before, there's several things that can be done to utilize your site, optimize it to the best of its ability, things that can be added in um, to make you climb those ranks with your site and then also, you know, climb the, the rankings for the Google My Business listing that we discussed before. So this, this guy right here. So now, um, you know, if this is something that you're interested in, in pursuing and um, getting in, you know, the, the overall goal here, bottom line, is to get you on the first page at least, right? And then um, second step would be to start climbing those first page ranks, you know, with, a, with an ultimate goal of, of beating them out for this traffic. Um, if this is something that you're interested in pursuing, if you're you know, wanting to grow your business and, and climb the ranks, please do not hesitate. Reach out to me um, and we can have a further discussion to go a little deeper into this. Um, you know, if it's not something that you're you're looking to pursue and if it, it isn't something that you, you wish to, to move forward with, that's totally fine. No harm, no foul. I do appreciate either way you taking, taking the time to watch the video and I hope the rest of the evening is wonderful to you.